All right, welcome back everybody. I'm starting this one off with a bit of a mouthful because I got a lot done in the last day or so. So, I got Recipe for Disaster started and did Fishing Contest, Jungle Potion, Nature Spirit, Recruitment Drive, The Golem, Shadow of the Storm, Witch's House, In Search of the Mire Cube, and Holy Grail, and I'm about to finish Framinic Trials. So, uh, yeah, let's go do that real quick. All right, there's Framinic Trials done. Next up is gonna be Hero's Quest. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem. I need an unfinished Harlander potion, but I don't have any seeds or Harlanders in the bank, so... Uh, Chaos Druids, I guess? Ugh. Okay, so I finally got the Harlander. It only took 67 Chaos Druids, which I know isn't a whole lot, and it's 1 in 25, but... Whatever. I got it. Let's go do Hero's Quest. Alright. And there we go, there's Hero's Quest completed. Up next, I need to do Shiloh Village and Underground Pass, and then I have all the requirements for Legends Quest. All right, there's Shiloh Village done. Up next is gonna be Underground Pass, unfortunately. I have literally already used like half of my food, just on this part, dude. Oh my God, it's so dumb. <laughs> I feel so bad talking to this dude. He gives you some bread and some pies and half a prayer potion, and then you're like, all right, buddy, time to die. We're just down here in this cave committing murder. Every man for himself. Sorry, fellas. Yeah, so I'm at that part where you have to, you know, walk across all these little bridges and stuff. And I got the witch's cat and all that stuff, but I've already fallen like three times now. I just, I hate this quest. I've always hated this quest. I remember the first time I did this shit, it took me like five hours because I was like... 50 agility, didn't have graceful, and was like just falling constantly. I remember having to bank for food like seven times the first time I did this shit. Oh my god. Alright, we're reaching the end of the shit show. Let's go, dude. Throw that bad boy in the well. Go. What are you doing? Do the thing. It must be a glitch. There we go. Good lord. You'll swallow my soul. What a strange thing to say. What a strange man. Alright, and that's Underground Pass completed. And for Legends Quest, you need 107 quest points, but I have 113, so I can go ahead and get that started here in a minute. Well, I was about to start Legends Quest, and then I realized I need 50 smithing and 45 herbal ore. But I can boost herbal ore with a botanical pie, which is pretty easy to get and make. And then I need to get 50 smithing, which won't take that long. I've definitely got the supplies for it. So I guess I'm going to get skill for a little bit. On the bright side, once I finish Legends Quest, I have all the requirements done for Recipe for Disaster. Except for the 176 quest points, but that shouldn't take too long. All right, and there's 50 smithing. Now I just need to go get uh, the materials for a botanical pie and then a new Legends Quest. All right, moment of truth. If I burn this pie, I'm going to be pissed. All right, there we go. I can go do Legends Quest now. Sick. Okay, so I lied. I'm not going to be able to start it yet. I still need to do some item collecting. I need some gems and whatnot. So, uh, about to go uh, do gem mining. God, dude. I'm determined, though. I'm getting this quest done today. I'm, I'm getting that herbal or XP. Alright, so now that I have all the items needed, I am starting Legends Quest. I'm gonna get this done today, and then like I said before, I'll have all the requirements needed for Recipe for Disaster done, except for the quest points, and I'll get 120,000 Herbal Ore experience, which should bump me up to 57, and then I can unlock Fairy Rings. So, fun fact, you need 50 strength in order to do Legends Quest as well, and I'm only 45, so I need to go get a strength level or two and make a strength potion and then come back. I just, I, I really just need to learn how to read. I swear. Ooh, another fun fact. The strength bonus you get from a strength potion is based on your level, and I have a strength, half a strength potion here, and it'll give me seven levels. So, I have enough to do the quest. Now I have to grab all these items again. Dang it. Imagine if I ran out of runes and had to staff bash him to death. <laughs> Stop splashing. 3 HP. There we go. He did. So I got to that part with the door again, and then I realized I needed another strength potion and had to go spend like 15 to 20 minutes um, 
killing hill giants until they dropped a limpwort root. That was that was just yeah, this is so dumb. I've the struggle has been real today. Yeah, so I'm fighting this dickhead again. Hopefully I am done soon. I honestly don't remember a lot of this quest. It's been a really long time since I did it, but I've been doing this for a good probably two hours now. <laughs> Forgot how long it was. Cool. He did. Now I can grow this stupid tree. Ooh, do I teleport out or do I... No, I run back. I don't want to... Um, I'm just going to run back. All right, here's another attempt at planting these stupid seeds. I swear, man. Please don't fail. Don't do that. Yes! It worked! Gods be praised. Well, hi. Oh, you're going to teach me a final lesson, huh? Be oh, yeah. I forgot you can't do anything while he's got his dialogue going. And so that's why you have to pray like that. Noise, noise. All right, we are cooking with grease now. Now I have to kill these three dudes again. And then I think I have to go back through the cavern and fight the demon guy again. I can't remember. It's like I said, it's been a long time since I've done this quest. Oh, okay. No, you don't have to go back into the cave. Cool. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna kill this bitch now. Let's go, dude. You gonna die? Excuse me, Mr. Urkel. Give me my damn Herbalore XP. You some bitch. Yeah, welcome to the Legends Guild. Let's go, dude. I get a cool cape. Um, excuse me. Would you hurry up and give me my damn XP? No! I did not just do that. Yeah, I can't believe I just did that. I just, I didn't go to the next menu with the herbal ore option and went up and clicked woodcutting on accident and just took the last 30,000 XP in woodcutting instead of herbal ore. I, <laughs> I'm so dumb. I, I just, I have no words. Anyways, I guess I'm gonna go do some herbal ore now. Jesus Christ. Yeah, so instead of actually going and training Herbalore, I'm gonna go ahead and do Fairy Tale Part 1, and then I'm gonna go and make another botanical pie and do Fairy Tale Part 2 that way, because it'll boost me to 57. So, yeah, fairy rings are getting unlocked today. Alright, there's Fairy Tale Part 1. I'm gonna go make some pie and then do Fairy Tale Part 2. Yeah, so the plan was to get fairy rings unlocked yesterday, but I couldn't, so here we are now. <laughs> I have to wait five minutes. It's so dumb. All right. And now I have fairy rings unlocked. Very nice. All right, so now that I've got fairy rings unlocked, all that's left for RD Medium Diary is Enlightened Journey, Hand in the Sand, Start Sea Slug, Start Watchtower, and do Tower of Life. So, uh, not too bad. I'm all right, there's Hand in the Sand done. One quest closer to RD Medium Diary. And that's Tower of Life done. So now I can do Creature Creation, which is a really good way to farm um, red spider eggs. And got this cool little construction outfit. And one step closer to doing RD Medium Diary. So now that I have Fairy Rings unlocked, I have quick and easy access to the Farming Guild, which is really nice. And then after I got that done, I had to go to work, but I finished up 55 Thieving on mobile and 65 Fishing on mobile for RD Knights and Kabam Bams, respectively. Um, I'm pushing up on 1300 total, which is pretty cool. And yeah, so right now, all I have left for RD Medium Diary is... Enlightened Journey and start Sea Slug and Watchtower, but I have to go get ready for work. So I'm probably going to just do some uh, Master Farmer thieving today and get some more seeds because I'm pretty much out of like everything. And I got this contract for tomatoes and I don't have any. So uh, yeah, after, after that, it'll be back to questing. All right, so I've done Watchtower up to the point where you can get the Cave Nightshade for the RD Medium Diary. And next I need to start Sea Slug and just fish something off of the uh, platform. All right, so I just realized that there's actually one last thing I need to do before I can do the RD Medium Diary. I need to get 59 smithing so I can make a Myth Grapple. Fortunately, I spent about an hour at LMS last night for a cheeky little one mil cast stack. And I have plenty of ores to get that done, so... Easy peasy. It looks like I'm going to Blast Furnace on mobile today. Alright, so while I was at work today, I got on mobile and went to Blast Furnace and got 60 smithing. I, I got 59 for the Myth Grapple and decided it didn't look right and went ahead and got 60 real quick with gold bars. And in the future when I go to Blast Furnace, I won't have to pay the foreman every 10 minutes, so that'll be nice. So, 
after that, I went ahead and actually did the Artie Medium Diary. So now I am all set for a 99 Thieving grind. And after 99 Thieving, that's when I'll be going and doing 83 Hunter for Dragon Implings to get glories. And then after that, my main goals are going to be Recipe for Disaster and Unlocking Kingdom. Because I really, I want to have a nice cash stack and dump that into Kingdom. And get, get really set up for the mid and late game. I'm sitting at 1322 total. I have the Artie Medium Diary done and 123 quest points. I'm honestly really surprised I still have the Red Helm. I figured I would have died to something really dumb by now. Like a disconnect or, you know, just something that you shouldn't die to. Like Waterfall Quest. But... For now, that's going to be it. It's going to be a little bit before the next video because, like I said, I'm doing 99 Thieving and 83 Hunter. And it's the holidays. So, you know, everyone's, everyone's busy, myself included. So, with that said, have a great day. Thank you guys for watching and have a great holiday season. Bitches!